Thankfully, JJ's just so good at what he does. He's so good with action. He's so prepared. He knows exactly what he needs from me, from me. So he makes it super easy. So I have to learn like, you know, 10 beats at a time, and I can do that. I can pick up that, that up pretty fast. The real challenge here was me playing kind of a romantic lead. <laughs> is completely out of my comfort zone so uh, yeah, that was more of the challenge than the physicality. I mean that's the thing we have such a you know we have such a cast of quirky characters and all the fight you know all the fight sequences are kind of they're you know designed to those quirky characters so they're all really different and interesting and fun. This was really great because I think in this film you see more of you see more of the true Palm Clementi of the Palm that I know <laughs> which is full of attitude. <laughs> So it's not like she's not Mantis in this film. She's like, I, I think, and I don't want to put her in a blast, but I think this is much truer to Palm Clementia. This is like a fun, quirky rom-com. <laughs> it's what it is. It's a, it's a rom-com disguised as an action film, and it's a perfect date night film, and it's just super fun. It's just really a lot of fun. It's a fun film that we were a part of, and I had a great time. Uh, doing it, especially being in such an action film that I'm not doing any action in, but it was just it was just a fun time a year ago, and I loved working with David again and working with JJ for the first time and being in Budapest. Yeah, it was a great experience. I tap I tap back, you know, from when I used to be a dancer myself, and also you know Maisie is also towards the end of her career, so it's something that I've experienced before. And aside from that, you know, just. Yeah, so from all those years of dancing that I, that I had the privilege to be a part of. I think that it's a fun film. I think that it's entertaining and it's just, you know, it gets you out of your everyday life and if you can have a, go and have a great time. It's a fun film. I'm so excited for everyone to see the movie. I, it was so much fun to get to work with Dave Bautista again and to work with my friend JJ Perry, who's an incredible director. And I, I worked with him before when he used to be a stunt director and uh, stunt coordinator, sorry. And uh, yeah, there's so much pure action and comedy in it and also a lot of heart that, yeah, people need to watch it on the big screen for sure. I mean, he knows exactly what he wants action-wise for sure. He knows exactly how to shoot it because he used to, uh, uh, he's done a lot of second unit direction as well. Um, and he uh, surrounds himself with the best people uh, in the stunt department, of course. Uh, who did such an incredible job and um, also he's such a beautiful person such a big heart always in a good mood and always just um, enthusiastic and and fun to be around and for me he's been such a beautiful presence in my life uh, on screen and off screen we've been friends for years oh you need to see the movie in theaters because of the big action scenes and the sound and the, and the laughs and just to share it with uh with an audience you know it's always better than just watching on this small screen you know first of all this is my dream come true this is like action movie comedy all together some of my favorite people and sofia Batella and dave batista i mean being kingsley what can i say you know uh, it's like one thing, one thing I know is that, you know, I'm just an old football player from Flint, Michigan, and every time I get to do this, it's just a privilege and an honor. I'm so happy. I said, you know what, I have to stay ready. Like, I have to really, because you have to be ready, and then when the opportunity comes, it's there. And so I went extra hard and extra, you know, because I'm getting older, and I knew, I said, I got to really stay in it. And thank God I did, because I was ready when the call came. It was so good. He gets so much respect from all of us. I mean, especially athletes, because he's actually one of us. This guy walks with a limp, and that's the reason, because he was actually out there on camera doing his thing. But he also was second unit on Expendables. And I mean, and then going on to bigger and better. It's wonderful to watch people get their shot and watch people grow. And let me tell you, it, I can't wait to work with him again. He is a professional. He is amazing. He's so creative. The, the last minute ideas he had, they all worked. Um, and, and he gets it. You know what I mean? It's, it was one of those things where we could just wink at each other. And I love JJ, like my brother. You know what I mean? And I can't wait to do this again. Oh, it's so exciting for me because it came to me in so many iterations of like 12 years ago to be the stunt coordinator, then three years ago to be the second year director, and all of a sudden I'm directing it, and here we are on the red carpet, so I'm super, super stoked. It's very rare that you can bring all of those amazingly talented action actors together, actors and actresses together. So this was one of the reasons. We rewrote a lot of the characters in there, like Botas was an aftermarket thing. The unintelligible Scottish brothers were aftermarket. The Korean team was on it. 
was aftermarket. The party girls were aftermarket, and they're cold as ice and uh, cold as the snow and just as sweet. So it was kind of like getting an opportunity to put all these characters that I was friends with in 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 the in the mix. I mean, really, the book was amazing. When I first read the book, it was like. This is sad to say, but I had seen Pulp Fiction not that long after reading the book. This is how long it's been in development for decades. And I was like, this is like, it was so fun and audacious, but it was like a Tarantino movie, but well, full on action. So I love the book. This Rand Ravitch wrote a great script. It's certainly the cast lived up to all the potential of the material and then some. That's what you want out of a movie because you could have great things on the page and if actors don't bring it, it's not as good, and this is the movie that actually exceeds, exceeded my expectations. That's why Dave did the movie, is because there's a great love story at the center, and I think that distinguishes it from just, you know, a lot of different movies. It actually has um, true, uh, true lies quality to it. JJ's the master. I mean, just, he's been, he's honestly, I've been fortunate enough to make a lot of movies. No one knows production like JJ. But the surprising thing is he's got great comic timing. He understands the drama. He got amazing performances and landed the love story. Joe Flood, the main character, incarnated in the Dave Bautista. It's like, it's, it's a dream come true. Dave is Joe Flood. Pom is a force of nature. I mean, her, her like the, 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 the fight she does with Tom Cruise and Dead Reckoning, a, everything she does is so intense and amazing. I, I, I'm pinching myself still. Grateful, just so happy and being able to collaborate with this amazing crew, with JJ, you know, old friend, inspiration, you know, incredible martial artists. So I don't know, it's just, I'm, I'm so happy enjoying the moment. It was a big challenge, let me tell you to kind of like mix the world of a flamenco with the martial arts and being able to combine that, you know? So how you put together the steps, like a pa 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 and then those posts into that little kind of technique. So that was a, that was a very fun uh, challenge, you know? It's a great combo, you know? You got comedy, you got a love story, you have, you know, Dave is amazing in the movie. Like he, he's so vulnerable, but at the same time, he's so lethal. But then when you're able to combine those two things, uh, you know, it's like a, you right away you, you love the character. Like once you, you, you want to, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a fun movie and you have all these crazy assassins, very entertaining. I definitely focus on action movies, but this had a really unique kind of love story to it. And uh, J.J. Perry made it incredibly fun and I think original. And, uh, you know, the action is there, but the love story really shines through. So I worked with him before when I was at uh, Silver Pictures and just knew that he could deliver on the action and just the scale and uh, I just totally believed in him and he is just such a great energy. I've always wanted to work with Dave before and you know he, he basically was the guy So uh, and Sophia and him worked together one time before and it really felt like a great combo um, and I think it really shines through.